Hello and welcome to this video tutorial that's going to show you how to install the ExpressVPN firmware on a Linksys WRT1200AC. So there's a little bit of prep work to do to begin with. To connect a Linksys uh, to the ExpressVPN network you need to get its uh, activation key. So the first thing that you need to do is uh, go over to your account inside ExpressVPN, click on the green setup ExpressVPN menu then you'll be presented with this selection of devices choose router and then on the right hand side you'll be able to choose the Linksys WRT1200AC and when you choose that you'll have a download button for the firmware which is also something that we're going to need the actual software that's going to be put onto the router from ExpressVPN and you'll also have the activation code so the activation code is a long key that is hidden as I don't want to show you this one that's here and um, you can copy it using the two little pages icon that exists on the top right corner of the box here and paste it into a text document and have it ready to use later on so now I've connected the um, ASUS router to um, my network port on my laptop. I have not connected it to the internet, the Linksys, and I'm also not connected to Wi-Fi as I'm doing this. So um, I then load up my browser and I head over to 192.168.1.1 and that will take you to the Linksys uh, homepage. Now, as it hasn't been configured, there's a, an agreement page to agree with. And as it's not connected to the internet, it's actually going to complain that it hasn't been successfully set up. So on this uh, error message, we basically um, delete the 552,000 and the address at the end. And we go back to 192.168.1.1 and you'll see that the main page will load to log in. The password is admin by default. And we're now uh, connected to the Linksys routers main menu. What we do next is click on connectivity and in this right hand section here where it says router firmware update uh, we're going to choose manual and we're going to choose the file that we downloaded from ExpressVPN so I head over to my downloads I head over to where I've saved the um, firmware and in this particular scenario, I'm making sure that I choose, as I've downloaded uh, various uh, other firmwares for different routers, but in this particular scenario, we would have the Linksys WRT1200AC version 1.3.3. And we choose that. And then we just simply click on Start to start uploading the firmware. Now, it's extremely important at this stage that we absolutely leave the modem alone that we do not interrupt this process otherwise we will be in big trouble if the process fails halfway through so as you can see the firmware has been updated I'm just going to check if the IP address has changed. On my network card. Yes, it has. So we started on 192.1.1 .1, and as you can see, it's now become 192.168.42.135 for my machine and the router is on 42.1. So now we can go to that address which is 192.168.42.1 and what we're presented with is now the ExpressVPN router page. Now the password 
is actually underneath your modem you will find the serial number the MAC address and then you will find a two sets of four digit numbers we're not doing the dash in the middle that it's separated with we're just doing the password numbers as we see them and we log in to the router now here is where we're going to paste the activation key that we found on the ExpressVPN website and I connect the internet to the yellow port at the back of the Linksys router now the Linksys will be connected to your ISP modem so just choose any of the ports that you have at the back of your ISP modem and connect your Linksys to that port I'm now going to paste the activation key in this box and click on activate so activating causes it to log out and now we have to type in the password again for the router which again is underneath in a white label where you see the serial number the MAC address and then you see two sets of four numbers type those in And now the router is activated you will see a option to choose different countries that you can connect to and you will also have other uh, VPN options and system network options to change the wireless identities as you can see you can edit the Wi-Fi name and you can also edit the password of your Wi-Fi under wireless security just type in a new password into this box thank you very much for watching that's how you connect a Linksys WRT AC1200 with ExpressVPN router software take care